Welcome back to Teleglitch, the Die More edition. Are you ready to die some more? Or rather, are you ready to watch me die some more? I hope you are, because I'm going to die some more. Let's go! New level. Yep, 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 let's see what I start out with this time. I didn't have time to grab any additional weapons before I went to hiding. All I got is this self-defense credit card from between my wallet. What? Militech credit cards can be equipped with a miniature, uh, with... What? What's with the grammar in this game? This is at least the third time, I think, that I've seen a totally wrong sentence. They come equipped with a miniature tasers. A miniature tasers. Ah, huh, oh well. And are used mostly by paranoid businessmen and women around the world. I've also kept a box of chocolate for the really bad times. Okay. Got that empty can. Self-defense credit card equipped with a taser. Okay, so is this any different from that shock blade thing that I had before? Because it sounds the same and it looks the same. Oh. Never mind, this thing has ammo. Huh. Okay. Well, we're about to find out how good this thing is. Oh, also, I need to be on the lookout for broken walls more this time, because I... I mean, like, the, not broken walls, the secret walls. Because I really want to know what's inside of them. It's got to be something good if they're so hard to find. I'll probably forget. But maybe before I leave the level, after I've cleared it, I might come back and look for... weaknesses in the wall or something? I don't know. We'll see. Alright, who wants to test out my new weapon? Hello! That... is that doing anything? Holy shit. Okay, yeah, that did something. Ow. Ow. And there's more. Let me up my knife skills. I want to get a bit better at the... oh, ow. Okay, I suck at that. Whew. What the heck is... Oh. Ow. Jesus. Okay, this gun sucks. Actually, it's not even a gun. Alright, just fuck you. Come here. Okay. What the, uh, more? I was gonna say, what is that? It looks like chicken, but it's actually shells. Okay. Got the shells. For a gun I don't have. Alright, let's make a big explosive. There we go. Let's go right. Because right can never be wrong. Ha, ha, uh, yeah. Okay, you can kill me for saying that. I give you permission. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. I just took something. Oh, I just took a shotgun. Holy crap. Okay, that's lucky. Whew. All right. Anything else in here? Yes. Another clip. Actually, it's technically a magazine, but whatever. Oh, hello. Oh, hi! I really wonder if I should avoid enemies. Like, I'm not... 
It just seems like I never have enough ammo and I never have enough health. And I wonder if I really should just try to get through the levels as fast as possible. Oh god, they're getting close. I really suspect that shooting every single thing might not be a good idea. I don't know, I just don't see what else I can really do other than rush around and attempt to find the teleporter, but the problem is if I do that, there's a pretty good chance I'm going to end up stuck in a corner. Like what happened in the end of the last episode. So, yeah... I uh, gotta keep a lookout for those walls, don't- I mean, this looks like it. But I tried to blow one of these up with a super explosive before, and it did nothing. So... Okay, didn't it say, like, ranged weapons? Hold on, is there... I think there's... What about the info? Like, item- oh god, whoa. Oh, there's apparently a ton of stuff I have not discovered yet. Monsters, story... Um, anything here about the walls? Oh, here we go. Secret walls. That are quickly walled off with temporary materials, resulting in damaged-looking walls that can be destroyed with ranged weapons. Damaged-looking walls that can be destroyed with ranged weapons. It doesn't say explosives. It specifically says ranged weapons. But, I mean, if a ranged weapon would work, why wouldn't an explosive... This looks like a damaged wall. I could waste all of my shotgun ammo on it. Ah, oh, fuck it. You never know until you try. And now I'm fucked. Maybe they're really rare, or they only show up in the later levels, not this early on. I don't know. Okay, I think I am actually getting better at using the knife, amazingly. Teleglitch space-time... Oh yeah, I've already read that. Come on. Show me what you're made of. Yeah. You wanna go in a circle? You wanna go in a circle? You wanna go in a circle? You wanna get stabbed in the face? Yeah, you do. Yes, you do. You wanna get stabbed in the face again? Oh, or you wanna punch... Alright, yeah, you could do... Holy shit, okay. That was bad. That was really bad. I mean, like this, I guess it could be a damaged wall, but it doesn't really look like a wall. It looks more like a pathway that's collapsed. Hmm. I think I need to use my chocolates. There we go. Oh, thank God. Please tell me you have a weapon. Of course you don't. But you do have a medkit. Oh, yeah. Gotta keep a lookout for damaged-looking walls. Damaged-looking walls. Although, what would be the point? Because I don't even have a ranged weapon at this point. Although, I do have explosives. Explosives. 
which I wouldn't really consider a ranged weapon, but if that didn't blow apart a wall, then I would be damn surprised. Okay, what have we got in here? Alright, not too many enemies. Anywhere to go? Yes. Canned meat. Damn it. Come on. Oh, fuck. Did I? Oh, God damn it. I didn't mean to use my med kit. I wanted to stab them. Fuck. Alright, not worth it. Nope. See ya. Don't know where I'm going, but oh, wait. There's something here. What is this? Oh, shit. Shit. Um. What is in there? Should I grab it? Yep. Goodbye. I don't know what I just grabbed. I think it was nails and an explosive. 38% accuracy. Woohoo! A new record! Oh. The lowest I've ever done. Good job. Alright, let's make another su- oh, whoa. Hold on. Alright, let me get out of this room before the noise drives me crazy. Okay, we can make a super explosive, we can make a nail bomb. Dangerous to user, nah. Disposable rocket launcher, that sounds nice. What the hell, let's do that. Whoops. There we go. Let's make a super explosive out of that. Let's make a nail bomb, sure, why not. Alright, so now I don't really have many options for escalating a threat, so to speak. If I encounter one enemy, or no matter how many enemies I encounter, my choices are to either stab it, blow it up with a rocket, or blow it up with a nail bomb. I don't really have anything in between, like a pistol or a shotgun. So, it might be a good idea. Ooh, this thing's gonna be sweet, although I don't know how fast it fires or anything like that, so... Yeah, I might waste my first shot. Um... But yeah, it might be a good idea to go across the level gathering every single thing I can. In fact, I'm going to do that. Anybody want to fight? Ooh, this is an interesting level design. Anyone? What is that? That is that? Tube. Okay. Alright, that's a start. Ooh. Alright, we've got a long pathway. Let's gather them up. Come on. I know you're out there. Oh yeah, here we go. Now it's a party. Can you get them to kill themselves in the void? I don't think so. Oh, whoa. Did that just work? I think that might have actually just worked. Hold on. Mm hmm. How did I get him to go in? Oh. Holy shit. I think I just discovered the secret. It's also really dangerous. Really dangerous. Oh my god. See, this is why I'm glad that I haven't read any tips or guides or anything on how to play this game. The fact that I just found that out completely on my own is really fucking satisfying. Like, I just want to briefly mention this. A while ago, I used to be a kind of person that would kind of, like, read as many guides as I could to try to figure out how to play a game. Like, Binding of Isaac, for example, I always had the wiki open, checking every single item, trying to figure out exactly what it did and whether it was a good idea to take it. But... But recently, more recently, I've been, I guess, getting more hardcore about playing games. Like, I like figuring out things on my own more than knowing them. And I feel, like, at least for roguelikes, I think that might actually be a lot, a much better way to experience the game than knowing everything. So I've kind of promised myself that I'm not going to read any guides or any tips and tricks on how to finish this game. At least, I mean... Like, if I spend 20 hours trying to finish the game and I'm not getting anywhere, then okay, I might. But 
I at least want to give it a fair shot before I even think about doing that. So the fact that I just discovered this trick on my own is so amazing. And if I'd read a guide, you know, what would be the fun in that? I wouldn't have discovered it. It would have been something someone just told me. The thing is, though, it's really dangerous. Really, really dangerous. So... I mean, I guess I don't really have much of an option. I'll have to keep using it if I want to stay alive. But yeah, I might end up accidentally touching the void with my shoulder and dying. Which would be very unfortunate. Alright, we've got a blast door here. So some control panel somewhere will open it. Oh, hi. We've got a lone one. Here, why don't you come with me? There you go. Goodbye. Weak walls. Weak walls. I keep looking for weak walls and I don't see any. Alright, time to go back. I'm trying to figure out if it's faster to time your slices or just mash the button as fast as possible. I think it's actually a little bit faster to time it well. Or about the same. Not really sure. Alright, what's over here? A bunch of stuff. Why don't all of you come with me? Hold on, is there anything in here? Ow. Alright, come with me. Come with me. Come with me, and you'll see a land of horrible nightmares and death. Alright, I need to hook them into it, like this. Perfect. Cloning Vat Support Area M34. Wonderful, I've gotten punched three times and done no damage. Empty can. Can't do anything with that. Huh, you call that a can-do? More like a can't-do can? W wait, what? Okay, that didn't work. Military Biology Ethics. Uh, Militech Corporation is a forerunner of high standards in military ethics. Ha, ha, yeah, sure. The corporation supports relevant academic research through numerous scholarships. All military bioweapon research scientists are required to present a military biology ethics diploma or complete a practical intensive training course in the facility. Our motto is... Kill ethically. Yeah, you sound like great people. Alright, I think when you press that button, they tend to come out of the woodwork. So let me grab everything first. Canned meat, I'll take that. Okay. Yep. It angered the amoebas, or whatever these are. Wrong way. Come on, you big fuckers. Get a taste of the void. Ha 
<laughs> that is so satisfying. Wow, that just like changes everything about this game. Now I no longer have to shoot them. Hmm. Alright, well this is what I opened. Holy crap. The heck is that? I will find out soon. Anyone else want to join the party? Okay. Well, that didn't work too well. Ah, uh, that kind of worked. Alright, let's try this. Oh, oh, uh, not quite. Maybe then... nope. Okay, let's just go back to the same place I did this before. Because it seems to work really well. Um... Yeah. <laughs> Remember I said it was kind of dangerous? Yeah. The main causes of too early of too early death back in the beginning of the second millennia were various heart diseases and cancers. Modern scientists are still baffled why people back then did not choose to eat more fresh plants and walk or exercise every day, even though they knew that was the solution for a longer and healthier life. Idiots, right? Indeed. <laughs> Uh, um, let's try that again. Didn't have time to grab any... Okay, what do I have? Knife, fusion batteries... Okay, so back to this fusion battery thing. Wait, I didn't grab the can, did I? Hold on, gotta grab the requisite can. Oh my god, okay. Need to find some void somewhere. Somewhere. Somewhere over the rainbow. Here, maybe? Please? Please? Wait, I think I see some here. Ooh, but can I get them to go into it? Yes, I can. Kind of. This is going to be difficult, because I'm also kind of trapped in here. Alright, I got a couple more. Um, hold on, what's down here? Maybe I can find a better patch of void, or whatever the hell that stuff's called. Nope, 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 nope. Well, it's not taking them out uh, in a huge group, but it is taking them out one by one. Well, that didn't work. All right, fuck it. Ooh, shotgun. I call shotgun. Because there's no one else here, so obviously it's mine.
Where the hell did you come from? Really? Well, that's not good. In fact, I would even go so far as to call that very bad. Come and get me. <laughs> Holy shit, that actually worked. Well, that didn't work. Nah, I don't want to use my shotgun if I don't need to. Alright, I'm taking shit tons of damage. And I'm almost dead. Fucking dead ends. I prefer live ends. Yeah, that void stuff really helps, but... You need to find a good patch of it to actually be able to get them to go into it. Alright, I've got a bunch of unexplored areas down here. How? Wait, if I've already been here, then where did you come from? Missed this. And this. Sweet. Let's combine that. Nail bomb. Hmm. I kind of want to give the can gun a shot just to see what the hell it does. Yeah, what the hell. Let's do it. Tin can filled with nails and explosive. Dangerous to user. Okay, is it actually a gun? Or is it just an explosive? Is it one time, or does it just, like, take your health? So basically, as much health as you have is how many uses you get out of it. I don't know, but I'm scared to use it. That was fucking terrible. That just shamed my whole family. Ooh, more chicken. Or gigantic cigarette butts, or... Okay, I guess they're shells.
probably just another description. Yep, space-time anomaly. I'm just gonna call it the void, because it sounds cool. All right, let's try out the can gun. Holy shit. It is one time use, but that is awesome. Alright, I think there's some void back here, right? Where? Huh. And we've got a dead end. Alright, what the hell? I've, I've got a bunch of big areas to run through, so let's go gather... Let's go gather up some more. Oh god, please don't take me to a dead end. Oh, okay, we're going here. Uh, sure, let's go. Don't know where the hell I'm going, but I'm going. Alright, military biology sect- whoa. Achievement death putting matador? Bomberman? Okay. Not even sure what those are for. And how can my accuracy be above 100%? Maybe that's not percent, but if it's not percent, then what is it? Oh, that's what Monsters in Void is. That is... That's what it's called. The Void. Okay. Good to know. Military Biology Sector, level 2. Let's try and grab what's in that chest without being punched in the face. Ow. Alright, I'm gonna take this med kit. The hell is that hardware? Ow. Void, need some void, need some void, ow. Well, this isn't good. In fact, this is very, very bad. Either need some void or I need to blow some shit up. Like right now. Well, let's go this way. Nope, nope, let's not go that way. Let's really not go that way. Let's go left. Okay, good. Nice open owl. Okay, there's probably some void in here, right? It's nice and big. Please tell me there's some void in here. Please, 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 please. Oh my god. Oh my fucking god. Void? Anywhere? Please? <laughs> I only have one explosive and it's not gonna be good enough. Alright, let's continue up above. That may be the biggest horde I've ever had on me. Oh, here we go. Here we go. This is gonna take a while. That didn't even work. Alright, anyone else wanna join the party? There's gotta be someone else up here, right? Oh, yeah. Oh, yes. 
And tons of void, thankfully. Ooh, nice. Just need to make sure I don't get myself killed. Holy shit, that is so effective. Wow. Okay, and now I'm free to explore all these areas. Damn. God, wouldn't it suck to be like at, at the last level and you're doing this and then you just accidentally walk into the void and die and lose all that progress? That would suck so bad. Go down here. <laughs> oh shit. Alright, fuck you. Six revolver shots, not bad. Actually, that's actually that's pretty bad. Oh, what is that? Six trigger revolver, uh, shooting six bullets in one shot. Um, that sounds maybe good against a boss fight, but that otherwise that sounds like a colossal waste of ammo. So, nope. Wait, is that something I can pick up? It is. I almost left you behind, you beautiful canned meat you. Okay. For the first time, I'm actually going to get to use the pistol. Last time, I instantly converted it to something that was crap. I think I made a nail gun out of it, didn't I? Yeah. The hell is that tapping noise? Thump, 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 thump. Well, I could make an automatic pistol. What the hell? Let's do it. Cool. Alright, let's test this thing out. Not bad. I still want to know what that tapping noise is. It's disturbing me. I think it's those things. Uh, was there a void anywhere near? Was there a void in this room? Yes, there is. Haha. <laughs> hey, where's the other one? <laughs> that little corner is just perfect for catching them. Alright, looks like there was a bunch of items in this room. Shells. Some explosives. Some more shells. 
Got 31 shotgun shots. Nice. What the hell is that thing? Oh my god. Okay, to the void with you. The fuck is that? I think it might be faster than... Oh, oh god. It might be faster than me. Ah, damn it. You avoided it. Is that a fucking boss or something? Or like a mini boss? I don't know what the hell that thing was. But it hurt. Where was the teleportation station? Oh. Apparently I was on the right track. Okay. Um, is it just my imagination, or is there only one place to teleport to? I thought there were multiple choices. Ah, whatever. I'm gonna go through the facility support systems next to make sure that I don't die because of a random life support protocol failure. I want to check on the manual emergency mode to make sure things will remain stable even if there's a crazy AI around. Okay, let's hope I don't get shot in the face by something this time. Memo to Chief Engineer 2. No need to check the air purification anymore. We found the cause. A goddamn zombie had got itself stuck in the engine. Must they be allowed free movement training absolutely everywhere? Yeah, that uh, that would cause some problems. Alright, let me take stock of what I've got. Bunch of shotgun shots, some revolver shots, bunch of automatic pistol shots. Even more shotgun shots, okay. Hold on, what can I craft? Nail bomb, what the hell? Let's do that. Six trigger revolver, I do not want that at all. Okay, good enough. What did I just hear? I think those might be some sort of a super zombie. That took a lot of ammo. Hold on, slow down. I need to find a void to put you in. Yes, just hold on, punching the back of my head while I read this. Uh, Militech canned meat, number two or whatever that says. It has been reported that live people eating Militech canned meat have received improved constitution and durability. Possibly because of the chemical enhancers that make organic tissue more dense and thus hard... Harder to damage? Looks like it says harded to damage, but I think it's supposed to say harder to damage. Side effects include increased aggression and sex drive. <laughs> okay, so the canned meat that I've been eating has been Im improving my defense? Cool. Alright, fuck you. Fucking asshole. Necrotic tissue fermentation area. Fermentation. They've been fermenting tissues. That sounds disgusting. Well, this should bring a bunch of enemies out of the woodworks. Poison Garden number three. The poison plants have started growing nicely, and I am especially excited about our very own plastic death tree. I love feeding her fresh plankton and seeing how she feels out her surroundings with the long hairs on the trunk. 
The tree bark can be harvested later as a resource for poisonous plastics, but should be completely safe in its current state. Sounds wonderful. Sounds very safe. Make a super explosive. Uh, disposable rocket launcher. Sure, why not? Oh crap. And that thing sounds like a freaking lion. Okay, I need some void, like, now. <laughs> okay. Well, I'm about to be hit in the back of the head, but a memo to janitor administrators. A ranged combat training instructor from Sector 6 has reported that a non-human combatant has lost its assault rifle during training in the support system sector. Please advise janitors to look for the weapon and return to Sector 6 supply officer. Lost its assault rifle during training in the support systems sector. So I'm guessing the assault rifle is in the support system sector. You know what? Fuck you guys. That sucked. That fucking sucked. I am about to die. Well, I used all my explosives and I have one hit point left. Other than that, that went pretty well. Holy shit. Okay, here we go. That's something. Decent amount of shotgun, no revolver. Oh, I actually still have some auto pistol ammo left. Amazingly. Oh, no. You're still alive. Fuck you. What is this? Oh, it's the base pistol. Well, that's really no use. Yeah, I think I'm going to die. Pretty sure I'm going to die. Oh my fucking god. Whew. Another one. If only I could sell them for money. Unfortunately, there's no one left alive to actually buy them. Okay, what is that? Programmable 8-bit microprocessor. What can I do with that? Wait, what? Detector. Detects enemy movement in tight pipe-shaped spaces. It works automatically. Sure. I don't know how that's going to work, but that sounds cool. Public message concerning nail gun number two to all facility workers. Uh, by productivity monitoring, by productivity monitoring administration AI protocol H403, a final warning. The buzz around the new shotgun based version of the nail gun has not helped the situation, and I still see reduced productivity in sectors 3 9. Or 3 through 9. If unauthorized scientists do not stop experimenting with these guns during work time, I will have to ask AI. Motivation protocol, blah, 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 to apply additional unpleasant motivation methods for compliance. Thank you, and have a constructive day.
All right, where am I going next? Let's go down here. What the fuck is that? Oh. That's telling that's telling me not to do what I just did. Fuck. Ah, all right, I'm gonna run around. I can't fight these things. Holy shit, the AI is really smart. What did I just grab? There's something and a bomb. Okay, main gateway. Please tell me I can find some void. Hello. There's some void. Not sure how I'm going to swing that with these fucking zombie things that are so fast. Okay, I got like one. That's great. Hold on, there's some more down here. Okay, got like one. Yeah, that's not going to work. That is not going to work. Memo to Chief Engineer. We need a squad of welder robots down here. Some of the water tubes have increased, have decreased pressure and are probably leaking. Also check the, ma the main air purification system engine. It has been reported to be making a strange noise and the smell of turpentine seems to be stronger than usual. Oh my fucking god. Wow, okay, I'm gonna die. Something's even shooting at me. Ah, wonderful. What's down here? More joys. More wonderful presents. Oh, some shotgun shells. That's great. Not that it would fucking matter. Where does this go? Oh. Great, it's a maze. It's amazing. Oh, fuck. And I'm dead. Well, aside from dying, that went pretty well. 72% uh, accuracy, it's actually pretty good. I killed 79 monsters in the void, okay. Nice.